Hello, this is exactly a week after the last time I shared a private game, and this time I am back with a new game which of course also a private server. Different from previous games, which were mostly MMORPGs, this time I will share an RPG game with very good graphics for a private server game. Okay, without further ado, let's check it out. So here I have a new account but unfortunately when creating a character, I forgot to unpause the screen recording even you can choose 3 different hero, so just go ahead. I've also completed most of the tutorials here. So first, there is a login event and from here you can get free recharge bags, gacha tickets, and other things. This online time event only appear when you first create a character, so don't miss this because the next day it will disappear. It doesn't take 2 hours to claim all of them, so I guess it's not that hard to get all these freebies. Then in the monthly login, here you can get free diamonds every week and you can reclaim it if you just miss a day. So if you miss the free diamonds section, you just have to reclaim it by spending 20 diamonds and you will get 1000 times free diamonds. Besides that you can even get SSR heroes easily without speculating in gacha. Then as usual, you can find a recharge event that allows you to get the SSR Sun Wukong even though I know most of you don't recharge, just the same as me. Next, because in this game you use stamina to play, here is also a feast event that allows you to get additional free stamina every day and if you miss the time, then you can also buy it for only 20 diamonds. And here I don't know which event this is, for sure you can get free diamonds here. If you want to get this of course you just have to play every day and see what you get. Furthermore, in this free SSR hero event, all you need to do is leveling and once you reach level 100 you can definitely get 2 SSR heroes and 200 shards which you can exchange with other SSR heroes. Not only SSR heroes, you also get abundance diamonds and gold here. Because you need to know that farming gold in this game is quite difficult if you don't get it from the event. Then here you can find events like Battle Pass but I'm also not sure because suddenly I got 50,000 points. So all you need to do here is just claim it because this is also a good freebies. Then the last of this tab is an 8 day login event. Here you can get other abundant free diamonds just by logging in consecutively for 8 days. And because this is a RPG game with various characters, so here of course you can do gacha and to get a grade SR or SSR hero in this game is not too difficult. So let me try it. And as I said just now, 
In just one try and I've got my second SSR hero in this game. Okay, because in this game also uses VIP feature, you can also get the free VIP level here. You only need to check your bag after claiming all the freebies that you got before, and there you can find a VIP card that can be used right away. And after you use the card, you will immediately have VIP 15 while the maximum VIP in this game is VIP 20. But unfortunately even though you get VIP 15, you can't claim VIP prizes for free instead have to buy them with diamonds, but of course the price has been discounted. And what's interesting about this game is of course the speed hack feature that has been given from the provider directly, so you can use the speed hack without having to look for the mod version first. Here you can speed up to 20 times faster though I think 20 times is too much to play, and you won't be able to enjoy it at all, or maybe your phone won't last. So after you activate the speed hack, all animations, sounds, and gameplay will be faster. This is great for those of you who want to level up as fast as possible. Well, before it ends, so I'll show you what I got from playing this game in the past few minutes. Okay, because it's nothing I can show there or maybe I've missed something, so see you in the next video.